the brand new series with an ultimate test. Take one player who's the only in the station. See who the best, then we say congratulations. You ever really wonder what sort of dance an Australian really does? Let me show you, cut. Try not to get too winded, but yeah, big splash. You at the That one comes called the kangaroo cry. What's up, big boys, and welcome to the best of the rest featuring PG episode number five. Nah, I can't do it. Not for this epi. Good eye, mine. Welcome to a sick episode of Best of the Rest, Cut. Welcome to Best of the Rest, episode number five. I believe it's currently number five. I'm looking at the table. Lebanon at four, China at three, St. Vincent Grenadines at two, and then in first place, we have Barbados, who was just absolutely incredible. 31 points and nine goals for one man of the match. Good for, like I said, 31 points. In this episode, we're gonna have someone that's possibly gonna contend with either, I think, the number one or number two spot. We've got the 30-year-old Roy Krishna, the Hyundai A-League legend, 88 pace, 66 shooting, 69 uh, dribbling, has the four-star weak foot, three-star skill moves, 5'7 the height, which leaves a lot to be desired, but Roy Krishna didn't realize that he was that much of a cult hero. I believe he's got a few cards, at least this one is his Wellington Phoenix side. If I have some Australian League fans or Aussie League fans in general, I'm sure you guys are well aware of this guy. But more than maybe just Roy Krishna, I'm excited about the squad that we're able to surround him with. We've got the likes of Team of the Season, Milos Nikovic. We've got Andy Kiel, who is my first ever red monthly foot champs reward player. We're gonna be playing him on 7 chem up there, 73 rated. We've got Castro, who's gonna be our RCM. We've got this guy, Troisi, who has 90 log shots, 90 shot power to go along with a little bit of 76 pace. Four star weak foot as well, Dr James Troisi plays for Melbourne Victory, and then of course, the legend himself, 80 rated, SBC, Timmy Cahill. Believe he got this because he was the highest goal scorer in the Hyundai A-League the year before. Three star week for three star skill moves, but he's got 99 jumping, 99 heading. That's what we would use him for. Uh, we might try to push him up a little bit more. As a matter of fact, we will try and set him on uh, get forward so, he has, uh, so he's a very attacking minded option. We've got ourselves Roy Krishna. We're going to send him and get him behind press back line as well as stay central. But this is the squad, boys. He's going to try and top the likes of this Ronaldinho, a.k.a. Jonathan Ronald Forte. 90 pace, just absolutely tore it up. Like I said, got nine goals in three matches in the last epi. But we're going to get into a few matches. We're going to get into three matches and see where Fiji, again, this is best of the rest, which means we take the one player that represents their nation in the ultimate team, the one nation that has only one player representing them in ultimate team and try to take them on an incredibly emotional journey to see who can actually rank in terms of uh, in terms of goal scored man of the matches and that sort of thing but anyway boys if you guys are still enjoying the series this late into FIFA 17 smash that like button let's just aim for something you know what I can say it now I'm currently in London at the EA capture event I can say it I can say it because this video is going to be going live Saturday or Sunday and that means the embargo's up. I'm going to be most likely capturing a bunch of FIFA 18 footage so you guys have that to look forward to. Uh, this is the first video that I've actually said it in just because I'm not allowed to say anything technically but this video like I said will be going live on a Saturday, Sunday or a Monday. So you guys will be finding out there. Possibly you will see already a FIFA 18 video on my channel by the time uh, by the time you see this video. But anyway, boys, if you guys are still enjoying the series, smash that like button. Like I said, let's aim for something crazy, like 7,000 likes on possibly. I don't want to. I don't want to end this series prematurely. But if I have enough FIFA 18 footage, I'm sure you guys would like to see FIFA 18 instead of FIFA 17. If you guys are new to the channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below. If you guys do want to interact with me on Instagram and Twitter, those links can be found in the description below. Let's get to match number one. Let's see how Roy Krishna and the Australian League team side perform. Let's see if somehow we can get more than nine goals with Roy Krishna across three matches. Los kids. Match number one, and we're coming up against. You know what? A very beatable side. Felipe Anderson, he's got Cuadrado, he's got Alan, he's got Asamoa, Miranda, Marquinhos, Alexandro Perez, and then he's got, I'm pretty sure that's Perrin in that, the, the squire. Keeper, FC Patria. More like FC Patricia. Patricia! Am I right, sweetheart? Honey, can you be quiet? I'm just trying to do something. Castro! 
in Osidava this time more careful than the last there's a Krishna beats them all still Krishna and Krishna does more oh, 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 oh Roy Krishna that has to be it to equal the clip of Barbados <sighs> that has to, we essentially have to get hat tricks in every match it took me in and gave me bread In the last, is Krishna beats them all. Still Krishna and Krishna. Roy Krishna, let's go one nil. Oh, that's what I'm talking about. 34th minute uh, has uh, eight goals to go and has to get a man of the match and at least one to, to draw it level. Is the A League up for it? Namely, is Roy Krishna up for it? Because it didn't look like he was at the start. Remember, boys, we started slow in four days well. In the last, is a Krishna beats them all. Still Krishna. Then Krishna must score. Boys, we can score four goals with him in this match. We can score four goals with Roy Krishna in this match. not start off well but I'm inspired now seven shots seven on target 53 percent possession uh, Roy Krishna with a goal in the 35th and the 39th should have had one right there in the 45th uh, but somehow that was able that was kept out you know for five he plays a little taller than he actually than he actually is he's five seven but dude he's got an imposing presence here we go goal number three right here But it is Castro, we get ourselves the 3-2 lead. And late into the game, 96th minute, beautiful piece of play. Keo to Castro, right around the defender, and just puts it in a place where the keeper's not able to get. Krishna, you know what? Dude, come on. Krishna, you got two more goals. You got two more goals in this match. And do we get the main of the match? If we get the main of the match, we do! So we get seven points in the first match. We get six points for the two goals, and then we get a point for the main of the match. So we're up to seven points. We need basically a lot of points. We need 24 points uh, between match number two and match number three. Nine shots, eight on target. Very, very even match. Looked like I was maybe going to run away with it in the, uh, in the first half, but he came away, equalized late, and then I just had enough in me to put us past and get the victory. Let's get to match number two. Let's see if Roy Krishna and the A-League side has it in him. Match number two, and we're coming up against an 88 Sonaldo, an 85 Ericsson, and a freaking Meta Martial. <sighs> What is that flying on me, bro? Oh! Oh, Krishna! I don't know how I got my hand on the controller to put that, uh, put the second effort away. And I pretty much lost, yeah, I, I pretty much, uh, Kareem Hunt, Kareem Hunt, yeah, I've lost my fantasy match. And we're at 10 points. We're gonna need, we're gonna need a second half miracle.
know when you just know that you're gonna win? Celebrating a score of zero. It's not about winning, it's about having fun. Whoa! That looked painful. It doesn't take him long before he ends up in shit creek. There's no one or two ways about it. We just got absolutely freaking trounced! Baby Jesus swag! Congratulations. Why though? I, I don't know. But just 17 shots, 12 on target. We just got absolutely freaking trounced! And it's embarrassing. Like, I know I don't have the best side in the world, bro, but that many. That sort of freaking ratio against me? Dude, that's honestly just makes me want to rip my nuts out. All right, boys, he's got himself a juicy out the door and a silver side. Oh my God. What do I, have? I have three goals. I don't know what I need. I'm not even sure I want to know what I need right now to uh, to beat Barbados. It's not going to happen. Bro, we're not even going to beat St. Vincent Grenadines at this pace. Ready for this. Oh, come on, Tim Cahill! You know what? I don't want to say it's out of reach because that's like sort of like giving up. Well, no, it is actually giving up. We're currently, I think we're currently at 10. Are we currently at 10? We're tied with Lebanon for fourth. Goals for man of the match. Welcome to the big show. Best of the rest, I watched that series. Oh. Why is my dude? This thing is dripping right now, bro. Why is this dripping? In Osidava, this time more careful than the last. It's a Krishna beats them all. Still Krishna. Oh, my Krishna, come on! Still one. Okay, so I think we're at the second third minute. Uh, we're past China, I believe. I think we're at 13 points. We need... We need two more goals to tie St. Vincent Grenadines. Oh! Yo! We're at 16! So we're good for third place anyway! 60 points! We need one more goal! We're not coming close to Barbados, but there's a chance Krishna and the A-League are going to be able to get up there. Roy Krishna! 88th minute! 4-1! Good for second place on the table! Stand up! Yo! He doesn't have distant shooting for anything, and he absolutely buries that one. The Krishna hat trick in match number three to put it away. And Roy Krishna gets himself the hat trick. And you know what, boys? No, we didn't take down Barbados. But you know what? We came second on the table. This was an underdog story. I mean, I came up against 10 silvers in this match in a team of the season, Josie Altidore. So I don't know how, if that's really an underdog story. But we get the 10.0. We get, so if I'm doing the math correctly, we had, it's your boy, bro. Great game, and somehow, I don't know how we came out on top. Looked like it was going to be a very even match the entire way through. So we've got Roy Krishna on six goals and two men of the matches, which is good for 20 points, which puts Fiji in second place behind Barbados and in between Barbados and St. Vincent Grenadines. So we are currently five nations deep into the best of the rest series. Now, I'm not 100% sure I wanted this series to go on a little longer. It might still go on, just depending on what I'm able to get at the FIFA 18 capture event. If not, you guys will see a, uh, a few more of these before FIFA 18 drops. And it could be something that I take into FIFA 18, maybe as like an end of uh, FIFA 18 series. But maybe you guys let me know. Like I said, hopefully it doesn't end by episode number five. Hopefully this isn't the last one. But, but if it is, it means that FIFA 18 is out and that I have plenty of FIFA 18 content to give you guys, which is I'm sure what you guys want. But anyway, boys, hopefully you guys did enjoy the epi. If you did, hit that like button. It is appreciated as always. And also, if you guys are new to the channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below. Below. I'm currently in London if you see me in the street somehow if you're in London and you see a rares way running down the street Just say hi, bro. I'm not gonna do anything. I'm just gonna probably say you want to go to Nando's But anyway boys, I will see you guys for another upload tomorrow till next time. Tschüss later a day